Hello and welcome to whoever's out there. I can see one. Alrighty. So. Going to do uh, continue with scenarios here with a new train, class 3774SN. So, get this going here. <clears throat> Raining, eh? Hey Slevin, how are ya? Just you and me today. We're gonna go on a new train. Let's see that out here. Let's see? Neat. We are on the east coast here in London. So this is, looks really tight in here, if you think about it. So let's unlock the doors. And there's a um, so so tight here if you think about it. If you have a look from the front, you can see that you do have like left and right, but uh, you you got this huge thing in the middle there, which is really stupid. And um, I don't know if they close the door here so you can. I don't know. Really weird. Um, good. I'm okay. What happened here? Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm good. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, yesterday I had to abrupt the end that, um, street. Looks like got a bit of a, uh, snow in here as well. It's not just rain, it's just a little bit of snow in there as well. Okay, there's something wrong with the brakes here. Okay, I think they are slipping. That's why. So that's it's a little bit of snow here, that's why it's slipping. Oh wow, I think that's I have to go careful here. So definitely gonna be interesting to do some to do break a little later on yeah I had to take my wife to the hospital yesterday she had some cramps in her belly and um, yeah she had to wait there for seven hours until they finally treated her crazy and we had to get back home <laughs> that's some realism yeah So what have we got? 2.4 Ks. Really you've got to be careful here with the speeding, otherwise this, the wheels are just gonna keep on turning. Actually I find I have found out today I did one tour with this train just to get it and I thought that this view here may actually be a lot more interesting. So check it out if we are from this above. What do you think of this? Because now, all of a sudden, we can sort of look around a lot. Doesn't that look neat? What do you think? 
Yeah, she's getting, she's feeling a little bit better today. Uh, we went to another doctor today as well this morning. And um, yeah, now she's sleeping a lot and resting because she didn't sleep at all last night. But she's better now. A little bit better, no, not much, but a little better. This is going to be a tough one to break. Hopefully we can still make it. Looks better, doesn't it? I think now you can sort of see around. and you know, Being in this little cabin, you can't see anything at all. So I think that one looks a lot better. We're already a little late. Yeah, did you see today? No one watches my videos at all on at YouTube anymore. Especially not these ones here. That was the first time I think I had one... No, no, I didn't have any viewers at all in the first hour. Never had that before. Absolutely crazy. Now, and five hours later, I think it was 18 people who watched it. 18. So, I'm not going to upload these anymore. That's just a waste of time. I just have the wrong people here. Say, eh? neat little houses here in England, on the east coast, east of London. Really neat. Yeah, I'm just going to continue uh, Twitch here. Go on Twitch here, um, but other apart from that, I don't know. Don't see it any worth doing any more videos at all and uh, uploading them on YouTube it's so dead I'm stuck at a 786 can't get higher if I have I had once 789 and then quickly down to 86 then yesterday up to 87 again then down to 86 again I don't know it's not working at all this one nobody is interested in, the truck nobody is interested in, so I'm just going to do this for myself and you know, for the handful of guys that are usually around. So you and I just have a chat today. can't upload the truck when I have the radio on, I just get copyright strikes, tons of them. So that's no use to go continue with anymore. I'm faster than you. Finished the uh, truck ride as well today. That oh shit! Oh man! 
Oh no. This is going to be too much. did the emergency. I shouldn't go down to number four, that was my problem. That was my mistake. Okay. That was my fault. The the brake here only goes until um, um, when you go down it goes to um, the minor is number four. Four is the emergency stop and I tend to sort of go too hard. I have to be careful that I don't go below three. So we got yellow two there now. Hey, the night. How are you today, buddy? So that makes two of us, makes three of us now. Good stuff. Got a new view here. I think this view looks pretty nice here. Ladies, men's and children's wear. Barber shop, see? Got some shop action here. Oh. Oh no. What is going on? Damn this. Uh, door, door. Gotta get out. One door. Lock properly. Which one? Here it is. Is that the one? Head down to the faulty door. Oh, 60 meters. Excuse me. There it is. Now it's shutting. Oh, they got Wi Fi here as well. Check it out. Try and make up the lost time. Yeah. Vehicles parked at unauthorized points may be clamped or removed without warning. Great. Well, let's get out of here. Gary, how are you? Thank you very much. I appreciate that. That is wonderful. Thank you very, very much. I'm glad that you're here. Not many people watch here anymore. I was already saying that um, I may um, may not upload these here uh, on YouTube because, as you saw yourself, no one really watches these at all. So I'm just going to do it over here. How is your situation in Orlando? Is it possible for you to watch me live at this time of the day? Or is other hours better for you? Maybe I have to reconsider because we've got um, two folks here from Indonesia and from Australia. Horrible time for them, almost midnight. And as for you, what do we have? 11.15, 11.16 in, in the morning.
so yeah we've got the US connection here maybe I should do it a lot later because then in Australia it would be daylight now then again everybody would be at work or at school as the night and um, yeah is it any good for you to watch live uh, Gary how is it do you enjoy watching live or and have interaction in it or would you rather go and say watch whenever the time during the day and don't want to be forced to watch at a certain time just do it whenever you want to how do you feel yeah it's 11 p.m. in the Philippines that is true but when you have school it is not so cool because now the stream I really only just now starts and uh, you know another two hours is usually midnight one o'clock in the morning so it's not really that fresh hot is it Oscrow doesn't care he doesn't sleep at all he just um, I don't know he knows the way to work. Yeah, you don't have to interact. It's glad. I'm just happy that you're there. You know, that's that's the wonderful part of it. I'm really grateful that you are there and always helping me out here with the interactions and not with interactions, but with supporting me. Huge uh, six subscriber package there last month and now again wonderful really appreciate it oh, and I am way too slow oh no I went too far again <laughs> gotta be careful can't go to four because the other trains always have six seven eight nine and whatnot so I found this view here, I think this one looks a lot better instead of in here where you can't really see anything at all. This is just uh, really nuts. Okay. If we stop, yep. Go forward again, brake is off. So. Losing time unnecessarily. Yeah. Um, so we got 400 meters. Let's go up here again. We can see a lot more. Some England, England action, East London, East England action. So we are a little bit behind. You got some parking action, parking areas here. Oh, what happened there? Oh, just open the doors. It's mostly automated, automated nowadays. I mean, these are all very, very computerized uh, trains, if you think about it. Even though they don't look it, but if you, yeah, I mean, have a look in the inside. So if you look in here, this is all, I mean, look at this. There's not really many switches here, is there? So this, this is very, very simple to ride, but of course, um, there's uh, ah, there's wipers here off. Okay, what do we have here? Horn. Um, oh, I'm going too fast. The wheels are spinning. Um, 
So this is all computerized. And there's not much to learn here. Of course, you would need to see all the signals and whatnot. So I think there's a lot more to it. But it's good. It is good fun for an amateur or novice uh, player like I am. And um, that's pretty good. I think my channel has come down to about five, six, seven, 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 make it ten. Ten regular viewers. Hi, Alex. Yeah, no dozing. Wow. Uh, actually, that's what I was going to uh, say. I finished the, uh, the, the route today. Um, I didn't do it yesterday, but I finished it... Um, yesterday finished it off parked and then I went to the repair shop and all the de got all the repair all the damages uh, fixed so have a guess or write down in the chat how much you thought that I had to uh, pay how much I had to pay for it. Um, how much money I had to spend for all the repairs there was tires I think two percent then the um, Body Works was I think 11% and, um, and and grill and some sort of stuff was one two three percent so you know just to get you an idea but the the, 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 um, the chassis was I think five percent eleven percent I have turned derailing off I'm pretty sure it is possible to do that. Um, well, actually, you don't have to take a curve at really high speed. Basically, it is when you uh, come into a train station where there's a lot of, you know, a lot, a lot of um, um, change uh, changes. And if you come in too fast on that, that would be the easiest bit to derail. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure if you couldn't say that uh, there's a market out there. But my problem is, is that these games are old and they're not the newest. And um, to attract new viewers, you would need to play games which have a huge amount of people uh, playing them and watching them. That's like... Uh, Fortnite, Minecraft, but even those, I mean, e even if I was going to, um, even if I was, let's see, um, even if I was to start playing Fortnite, for example, or Minecraft, I wouldn't get more viewers and, and people to watch because uh, those people who are doing Minecraft and whatnot, they've got their thousands of viewers because they started the game in the beginning. So anybody who's starting the game right now, he would have uh, no chance uh, to get himself a huge crowd unless he sits in a bubble bath and a tight bikini. Then, of course, that may be different. That, that will be different. And female. So, yeah, that is, uh, that is my handicap. Let's go forward a little bit. A little more to go here. Oh, well, we have 22 minutes. 22 minutes, 22 seconds. 30 seconds behind. What's this, 20k, 15k? Yeah, and a pro game, I, you know, a pro game, I wasn't... Oh. Oh, sand. Oh, this is where sand is. I do have sand. What happened now? People are in there? Uh, I, 
these pro gamers weren't pro gamers. They all started the same as me. It's just that they started years ago or um, they just started when a certain game started that became really, really good and really famous. So let's go up a little bit. Make a little. And then we got some good views here, folks. But what have you? Stop at location. Hold on, hold on. There's, what do you mean? There's a stop here? Where's the stop? 300 meters? 400 meters? Oh, we never stopped. Oh no, something went wrong. So I didn't, I didn't stop there. Want to get off here or what? Okay, this is going to be interesting because I didn't notice it. For some reason, we didn't stop at Glind, so we're going to get penalized here, I suppose. What happened there? Anybody see that? If I go back, um, I will have a red light, and once I have the red light, it's not going to turn green again. So, hmm. So, where's our next stop? Hmm. We'll wait, wait and see what the next. The problem is that I do not know where the next station is going to come. Does it say here anywhere? Let's have a look and see over here. Uh, Glind at Lewis five minutes after. Okay, so something went wrong there. Something went massively wrong. <clears throat> but I don't want to keep crying about um, not getting any viewers. All good here. I don't have to go all the way back to that uh, station there. I think we have failed uh, that one. But we stopped and everything, so something went wrong. station is going to come, what's going to happen then.
So this is where you could derail here easily if you just um, have this here. Yes, I've seen many, many uh, as well that throw so much money at their hosts, it's unbelievable. So, what will happen now? He's not showing anything really. So I think we will have to get out. We will have to. get out of here. I want to get out of this place if it's the last thing I ever do. I want to get out of this place. And we've got a red light there as well so at least yeah so we won't be able to go back train is even longer. Can I sit down here? Sit down there, it is. So, we're going to go back here now. Something is wrong. Okay, guys, see you. Good night, and see you, uh, Gary. <sighs> so, why can't I stop this here? Get out of here. So I think we uh, stuffed that one up. So should we restart it? Let's see how far we came. Still got a long way to go. I think we may just um, restart. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> That's good, Gary. Thanks. Glad you're still going to be around. 
doors are open. Yes, Alex, you are correct. My fault. Ah. Okay, too late now. Or maybe I'll do something else because we've already seen this, so it's no use doing this again. We'll um. We'll um. We'll do something else. Plenty more to do. Plenty more to do. Let's do cutting closure, whatever that is. Oh no, I think that's the different truck train, right? I think that's the other one. I haven't done that one yet. Yeah, no, we're not going to do that. We are going to do that another time. We're going to do the next one then. Scenario Enthusiast Excursion. Enthusiast. We'll do it the other way around. Hopefully, the weather is going to be better now. Where are we here now? We're still in Brighton? Yep, we're still in Brighton. As far as Eastbourne. So, but which um, station is he at? Head down to the platform. Yeah, ah, this one here. Yeah. Running, running. So this is going to be our train here. Weather, a little cloudy. one is so much easier. So let's uh, check out the situation out here. We're a huge train here. Okay, the gang. Smooth walking, guys. Smooth walking. too large for that screen there or should I make myself smaller? What do you guys think? Yeah. Zombie person again. when the signal to wait how long what is going on here now the light was green oh no not again so are we are good now or not because this doesn't look good at all. I think we need to go backwards. No, go violate. Yeah, now we're good. Go via Lewis, stop at location eastward. I hope we're going the right way here. I was able to look at this. 
right? Lots and lots of people here, right? Seven miles. Wow. So as soon as we go into a tunnel, well the tunnel is high enough because well, sometimes you will just be straight down there. See? You immediately get put down there. So as soon as you're out of there, you can go into the upstairs again. Not at the moment. The train is still inside. There we go. Now we're outside again. We can look a bit, a little bit on left and right here. Look at the uh, England. Let's see what it's like here in England. Look at all these houses on the right hand side. I think this is a lot better view, guys. Don't you think so? Just sort of. Uh, fly above the uh, train here. What do you guys think? So we can go a little faster, you know. buildings here yeah I think this looks a lot neater than uh, just uh, sitting in the little cabin there can't see anything at all of course every now and then you need to have a check out that you're not going too fast around a little exit some soccer action here passing through please stay back Stadium there. Who is it? American Express Stadium. Oh, where are we? Tunnel. Well, um, yeah, I suppose that is a possibility if you would muck around and just sort of not go the right way and just totally stuff this game up I suppose I do you guys enjoy that do you guys enjoy that it's when you when somebody is unrealistic and totally crashes everything and derails and uh, just for the fun of it maybe it's more exciting than just doing it the proper way eh? That'd be interesting to know. What do you guys think? Having uh, realistic and serious stuff here, trying to make the times and um, yes, yeah, some sheep action. Not all the time, but every now and then, yes.
But I guess those are the guys that get the viewers. I mean, obviously they are just uh, narrow-minded viewers, maybe. But then again, maybe it's just maybe it's good as well because um, everybody has to work hard and um, needs to concentrate. So every now and then, just for relief, it may be good fun to um, you know have some craziness. I usually have a good session where I mess around and have fun when I'm driving like yesterday. Wow, did that go bad. Alex had uh, tears streaming down his eyes. Yeah, exactly. That was yesterday. It was horrible. So actually, did you guys uh, check uh, did you guys write down any numbers there? How much uh, I had to pay for the repairs? forgot because I, I think that's when I stuffed this up here that's when I got um, away from the situation sixteen kilometers and 1.3 wow we have to go really slow through that um, over the bridge there Obviously, no other. So we'll have to go really slow through that train station. should um, get down a little bit so we can see what's going on what's the reason for that we're not stopping here we're just going through check out Lewis here and check out this area, check out the city. Stop is East Warren. Should be allowed to go a little bit faster very soon, not much. The train needs to get through there. As soon as he's all the way. Ah, that was, that's what those numbers were, 10k and 20k's. Gotcha, yeah, I did remember that. So, uh, no, that was 5,600 and something, just below 5,700. 
that was like yeah, I remember those numbers and I forgot about it again. See? Silly, crazy. So old. Can't remember a thing anymore. Get some more soccer action there. Some river action. So, 21 kilometers to go. So the airport, as you guys have noticed, was not released today. So maybe tomorrow. Are you guys gonna watch it live? It'll be at 5 p.m. Whenever it's gonna be. Whenever they release it, and hopefully they're going to re let me know early enough. But if it's not 5 o'clock, if they release it later, then I will immediately um, get that video going. That'll be the last boost, I guess, because I've been watching um, uh, some, some chats and some Discord channels about uh, Tower 3D. And it seems like not a lot of people bought um, Daxing. I mean, I could be wrong, of course. But um, um, there's not a lot of comments about it. Not a lot of people seem to have bought it. And I wonder how it, the next one is going to be. Uh, how the next one that's going to be released tomorrow or maybe Thursday or who knows not sure I'd be very very interested to see if people are going to buy that one they probably will uh, it's an interesting airport I can't say I'm not allowed to say but um, I, I'm not no, I'm not sure but I have a feeling that I think that's it. I think that's it. Then that the game is gone. It's dead. I don't think they have m much many sales there. So um, that is. I'm, I don't know. I think it's over because nobody's watching my videos anymore, and other viewers or other uh, people that produce these videos as well, they get hardly any viewers. Um, the the other guy who uh, did daily ones at um, daily daily at Twitch there he he hasn't released anything for a couple of weeks now he didn't go live uh, no it's not Shiphole because Shiphole is too big same as Chicago you can't do these anymore uh, the the computer the game engine just has no chance at all of uh, doing all do all the calculations and not but the airport that's coming now is really big it is huge and um, it's not even finished yet there's still extensions being done to them so there's going to be two more runways coming in years to come and um, so but this one is a big one definitely is a big one um, yeah, it's. But you guys will see. So, I might might I may be able to get a few more viewers uh, there for that video. Then, uh, if it comes tomorrow, I hope it will come tomorrow, because that'll give me the opportunity for Thursday to do a regular schedule on that airport with modifications and everything. Um, and on Friday, there's a spoiler for you. Um, Friday will be a live stream multiplayer with Eli Grimm. And uh, we will be doing Paris. It was uh, Eli's um, choice.
to go for Paris uh, at 5 p.m. around about 5 p.m. depending on if we get everything organized because the last time we did a multiplayer was um, months and months and months ago like half a year ago or something like that and uh, we need to realign the computers again so they work together um, yeah so that's gonna come on Friday live stream at 5 p.m. Paris Eli and myself so that's coming and that will probably be the last time or the second last time that we will ever do a multiplayer again because I think uh, it's, it's gone the, the game is gone it's gone unfortunately it's sad it's sad but it's true So that means Twitch wise, um, Twitch wise, there's going to be a, um, a break. Um, if the airport comes out tomorrow, we'll go live on YouTube on Wednesday. Live on Tube. No, we'll actually. Ah, on Thursday. I think what's on Thursday something was ah yes there's something on Thursday so I probably won't be ah damn it gosh maybe I will do a short yeah I will do a short one on Thursday if from of the new airport but it'll have to be a really short one only an hour because at 6 30 I have um, something that I have to do so if we start at 5, maybe I'll start at 4.30. That'll give me an hour, a sort of um, 60, 60, 70 movements. Yeah, 60, 70 movements. And then we should be finished by 6, 6.15. And then that'll be Thursday. Then Friday, the live stream uh, at 5. That'll go a few hours, two, two and a half hours probably. And on Saturday, Saturday, uh, there won't be a stream on Saturday because we've got invited and um, so I won't be home. Um, so Saturday there will not be a stream and then Sunday, Sunday will be the next Twitch stream really. So Sunday at 5.30, always Saturday and Sundays most of the time will be 5.30 but this Saturday there won't be a stream so you guys can get the barbecue out and um, oh wow oh wow we are way too fast we could derail if we have we may have to do oh wow this is going to go way too fast there's a corner here, tight corner. Easy. Driving significantly over the speed limit. Two AM barbecue, yes. No, I mean what I mean is you can do a uh, proper barbecue on Saturday because in the middle of the night you won't need me. Oh, well, that's right. Yeah, I got you. I got you. I got you. Yeah. Well, for some. But you can do plans for Saturday and Saturday night. You can go dancing Saturday night. How's the nightclubs are open there the night in, um, in your area or you're not the guy for things like that? What do you do? What do you do privately? Oh, that was awesome. That was slamming actually. Said it would be a good afternoon for me to go plane spotting. Okay, yeah, good. Go for it. Two 
2 a.m. barbecue, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, actually, so, so on Saturday, Slavin, you can go to bed early and be fresh again for the week after. So four and a half kilometers to go. So uh, let's have a look around the area again, left and right. These are some electricity towers here that you can see. We've got electricity wires going from one to the next to the next. Some washing been done. Get some trucks with graffitis on, of course. Or you go to your B streamer. That may be possible as well. What's this here? Water? It's a lake. Yeah. Ponds and lakes. So 1.9k. We've got some high rise action there in the back. So that must be Eastbourne. We've been going a little bit too fast here. Oh, we need to slow down anyway. Some industrial action here. And we're heading into Eastbourne. Some Eastbourne action. Roads here. Ooh, that's a view, isn't that a view? That's a view. Hi, Nason says hi, and the next sentence I hate these trains. How about saying something positive like twice in a row? Hate. I hate these trains. How about saying, ah, oh, these are not my favorite ones? Get in here and we'll get ourselves a better look here. How about saying how you are today? How was your day? Have you done any uh, applications? Any results? This is no way these amount of meters. That was an enjoyable run. Thank you for ensuring it remained fault free. Yes. All right. So maybe we should get some people out of here so it can remain fault free. Oh, nobody in there. I came actually in so many like uh, I went to London Gatwick and the train stood there for 40 minutes because of coupling problems you were in London today 
Oh, no, just at some time. Okay. Yeah, okay, well, I understand that. Hate is such a harsh word. Hey, folks. Hello. So you've been on this one, eh? Well, you should have driven with me. No worries. So, as you can see, the people can walk through here. So if we have a think about it, like we are sitting here on our own. We have a door here. And... Um, when that door is now open, you can see that there's a walkway and there's the other door for the other guy that sits down there. Um, but if you have this closed, these people can actually uh, walk through. Mm -hmm. So let's check out what we have here. These are all the trains here. The, the What are this? Can't go any closer. Opens something. Can't read it, unfortunately. So we're going to wait another minute. Can we see this? Oh, here we go. We can press that and then we can up. We can change this. And then we can confirm. So that is, so we can change that. What's this here? Cab light off? Oh. Door release, all release. Still, so you get actually, you get extra points for this as well. Couple, here, there's your coupling. <laughs> sand and gone we're finished another driver will be operating disembark to complete this duty sure will mate and let's get the hell out of here close it up oh open it up again something went wrong Set the power brake to B3. There's B3. Climb down. Disembark. Get out of here. Close that door. And then 17 meters. Hey, get out of the way, woman. Ah, oh, there we go. So much for that. Oh, we only got a silver medal. <sighs> so we've finished that, and uh, let's see what else we got. You drove in the setting of the Cap Eastbourne end. Let's see what, what do they want. Now, welcome to Lewis. Please swap with the driver of the train on platform 3 and complete its run through to Eastbourne. So, where's platform 3? Well, it's getting less. Ah, oh, here's 3. There it is. Yeah, get out of there, punk.
messengers. And bang on. Oh, actually, wrong ones. Ready to go. Hi, Gil. How are you? You're late today. How's work? You had a 20 second commercial? Wow. I haven't, I don't, I don't have any ads turned on. I've, whatever I was able to turn off, I, I turned off. So look at this view here, gear. I'm heading, flying above here so we get some scenery action here. So what do you guys like uh, is on finish in four hours? Well, I'm glad I can help you to get through that part. Just dropping by on a quiet moment. Okay. Um, so let me, well, since we've got the elite here of um, viewers of this channel, what do you guys like better, the train or the truck? You've got a uh, truck couple of days with trucks and uh, this is our fourth I think for the trains of those two what do you guys like better or like or actually let's go let's go one more step let's take the tower 3d as well and uh, I would like a hundred percent of you guys on how much you like like 60% tower 20% train 20% uh, trucks Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is wrong. Um, so give me some percentages on how much you guys like what subject. Train, truck, planes. Let me know. Hold on, I'm just going to let the cat out. So now we can resume. Fifty truck, twenty-five each train, tower sixty, forty, truck zero. Wow, didn't like the trucks at all. Crazy. Wow. Okay, interesting. Okay, we got the uh, then the trucks there. I'm waiting for Uber Simulator with annoying passengers. Good one. Tower only if it adds something like the new airport and stuff. Yeah, stop at location Glind, which we didn't before, so we need to look out for that one. Ooh, let's get over that bridge. We need to jump over that. We do some um, some train surfing here, folks. If nothing new, let's say Tower 20, Train 40, Truck 40. Interesting, but it pretty much explains exactly what I'm feeling as well that people are not really into tower anymore and that's why the viewers are going down um, Unfortunately, viewers are going down with, uh, I mean, train and uh, nobody watches that at YouTube at all. Like I was mentioning before, first hour, zero views. And until now, probably only about 20, 25 or so. I don't know, I haven't looked yet. 
Ah, damn it. But at least we have the time. Well, which is actually good because uh, train 40, truck 40, that means uh, most of you guys um, enjoy the truck and train uh, the truck and trains which is good because I enjoy those at the moment as well and um, and, and that is something which is good because I want to keep continue doing these so uh, not watch your videos because they are too long yeah I guess a lot of people do that and I had like 18 people after five hours today with an average viewing time of one minute so this one is not going to see the daylight of YouTube so I think from now on everything that you see here this is where it's going to be and where it's going to stay even with the um, with the truck I'm going to keep the radio on um, and, uh, there, and and nobody ever hardly anybody watches these videos after after the live stream anyway so most people just watch it now or they just come in for a second and they leave on YouTube nobody watches them the truck ones I can't do because of copyright infringements and therefore it, this is going to be the main channel to watch me really is uh, all the life's ones here That's what's going to happen folks It's dinner time at Nas Horns Okay, see you later Nashorn. And Guru doesn't like truck at all. Neither does Nashorn. Uh, then again, you guys are twins, so that does make sense. No, I don't take it personally. It's just very sad, really. But, um, yeah, one of these things. And true, if the new game ever comes out and when it does get released, I don't know, I honestly don't know if uh, people are going to buy it. I just don't think so for some reason. Because um, people are so fed up with um, um, the developer not really taking attention to it. So I think the people are not going to go crazy and buy it immediately. I think they are going to wait a few days, a couple of weeks maybe, to check out um, what others will say and do, and then it'll, you know, unless it's really, really good, because this game has been out so long, and so many people have uh, bought the DLCs and spent hundreds and hundreds uh, on the new airports, that it's going to be interesting to see on uh, because you, you know that you will have to spend all over again for the next few few um, years so I, I'm not sure that could be an interesting one if people are you know willing to pay that much again especially unless it's just totally out of the world so what do you guys think are you guys do you guys think you could be tempted in buying this after you've seen this. Do you have? Do you trust um, the developer to have a real good product? And, you know, really crazy, um, where you could actually like this, see some trees which are not floating above the ground and uh, buildings and or whatnot. Do you guys think so? Let me just um, stop here.
morning guys. Yeah, I think so as well. There, there have to be some major... I, I, I mean, I have not seen the teaser videos. Um, so I can't say, I, I, but I believe there are some videos out there which are showing a little bit what's what's going to happen. So um, I think I think that is that is a lot of people's opinion that. Um, they, that they've all just been very, very disappointed. And I think uh, they they lost a lot of um, trust, um, and that, that is sad. That is really, really sad. And um, and a hundred to two hundred dollars, like the previous, um, and and waiting for a sale. I mean, the first time ever they did Daxing immediately as a sale, half halfway down. So somehow they probably knew what was going to happen. It, I, I'm pretty sure it would have benefited immensely. And I've even told them, I said, listen, um, the guy who's going to give it to you is going to give it to you for free. You don't have to pay anything. We just do a, um, in, the, in the real traffic, just add in the real traffic, add that file, put it in there, and then you're good, good to go, and people would, uh, you know, enjoy the game a lot more with the cameras and the and the, and the colors and whatnot. But they they are very scared people, it seems, and um, that they may think that they get sued by whoever did the modification. By you know, but it's crazy. They don't. They didn't want to take a chance. But maybe they are just. Uh, we could speculate here forever and a day what the reasons may be and um, I mean I have a few theories on, on why but um, but they, there's probably certain reasons why they didn't they don't want to do that and so it could be interesting Well, yeah, there are a lot of bugs in there, but that's simply because it seems that they don't have the personnel to take these bugs out. So, I mean, probably these computer experts that know how to change these, um, to, to fix all these bugs and whatnot, they probably cost a lot of money and they just don't want to spend it on them. Uh, they don't want to spend a lot of money on fixing the bugs. They just uh, probably just want to go and say, you know, let's make the quick bug. Possibly that. Yeah, unfortunately, I am. Yeah, I see it the same as you guys do. And it doesn't have to be that way. I mean. If you have the monopoly on a game that nobody has with the voice recognition, you know, nobody has that. And, and it's not just easily done. I've spoken to a few guys who are computer programmers and asked them, you know, you know what's behind this? And, um, and they said it, it takes a lot of work and uh, to get a game like this going with graphics and all, all that sort of stuff um, it will cost probably about a quarter of a million to develop and, uh, and then you need graphics designer and they obviously want money as well but it definitely wouldn't be impossible to make another one and to make it a lot better than this is one's now. So that it is possible. 
definitely is. But then again, we don't know the numbers. We don't know how many games they sell. I do know that in Argentina, uh, that game, the, the airports, they sell like $2 or something like that because the people can't afford them. So there are countries in the world which, uh, which, which can buy this really, really cheap, um, but unfortunately you can't get into the market. Um, you can't get into the market because uh, you, even if you need a, a VPN or something like that, it, it won't work because you would need an account in that country. So you can, um, uh, and, and it's so otherwise, it's just not possible. But you could get it a lot cheaper, um, as in now. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. It's their type of strategy is what they want to do. I don't know, you know, what I've asked them what their strategy is and they said, well, this is none of my business. Uh, I said, I know it's none of my business, but I'm just sort of like to try to understand why, you know, why you are, why your strategy is, is like this, you know, you know, what's the thinking about that behind that? Um, yeah. They just don't do it. They just want to do their way. But like I said, there may be very, very good reasons on why they want to keep a low profile. wait and see if the new game comes out because I think it need, it'll need to come out soon because I don't think there's not going to be a lot of people buying any more airports uh, of, of this of this game so let's have a look around here left and right Get some fishing uh, ponds here do some fishing we got some sheep action or cows probably sheep yeah probably sheep the cows usually have those black spots So um, they should hire, he seems to know, he definitely knows what he's doing, but he has a very good job himself and he said, and I've asked him, I said, you know, would you work for them? And he says, no, nope. uh, his job is way too good. And he says, uh, he's not gonna, he just does this for fun. But unfortunately, it seems like he's so frustrated as well because he doesn't, he doesn't do anything anymore. He's not, um, you know, he doesn't do any more modifications and whatnot, so he's pretty much out of the race now, so there's not going to be any more modifications. I've asked him, I said, is that it? Or do you still think that you may um, do a little extra work? And he goes and says, oh, he's just very busy at the moment and, and, and probably very disappointed as well because, uh, you know, pretty much he only works for, did it for me and um, because he just loves the game so much and he loves mucking around with it but I think he, he, he deserves so much more praise and that would basically mean for the developer to allow for that game to, um, to be released Yeah, um, there is no competition, exactly. And, and if you don't have competition, then obviously you do not need to do anything. And who knows, maybe maybe they, I mean, they are having these other projects as well, this Embraer plane, I don't know what that is. Uh, if it's probably for, for Microsoft Simulator or something like that. And um, then, they have some other stuff they're working as well so maybe they'll just do this you know on the side like 
get somebody to you know get somebody to program the uh, the new airport you know and use the graphics uh, that you know maybe that guy knows the graphics as well and uh, puts up some buildings then you've got the testing team that um, you know that that is works for free and um, yeah that one work they, they work for free so they don't cost anything and then I don't know how much advertising and whatnot and if they sell 10,000 of these games at $15 on average then um, they'll just get themselves a few thousand on the side every couple of months and maybe they, that's enough maybe they're happy with that maybe they're not keen on becoming millionaires but maybe they do get millionaires because they sell hundreds and thousands of this game I don't know I don't see any numbers yes um, hold on uh, let me just take a look out here yes uh, multiplayer with Eli, we're doing Paris on Friday, 5 p.m. Maybe a little bit later, but uh, we are meeting up at 4.30. We need to get everything set up. So hopefully when everything gets set up, then we should be right on time at 5. But hint, hint, nudge, nudge, knowing Eli, that is... Uh, always a sketchy thing so it could be 5.30 or 6 o'clock but uh, it is planned to go live at 5 p.m. No, you definitely can't risk that. I mean, of course, um, I believe guys would pay like maybe five dollars or something or five euros for the add-ons or for the mod modifications. Maybe they'd even pay ten. Um, and if he gets half of that, that would be lots. Maybe he should get it all, really. I mean, it's his baby. But... Um, just can't do it. You know, if they um, if they sue him, who knows? Then um, then it wasn't really all worth it, right? public service complete for the night please take this train out of service over to the yard for cleaning and storage until tomorrow okay so we're not gone yet we're not finished yet so what do we need to do we need to um, power B3 turn that off get our good old key out of there and head to the other train open that one up and then go. Let's close it up again. Moving, moving, moving. Oh, hold on. We can. Can we do anything here? Nope. Okay, out of the way. Slalom. Hello, lady. There's still a lot of people in the train here. Hey. Where's the door? There it is. Come on. Forward. Lock doors on the right hand. Oh, we need to lock that one. Close these. Need 
to close this one down because otherwise we won't drive. Will that work? Oh yeah, it's still open. Let's see if we have a um, close door close. It's gonna get wet there. It's gonna be wet. That's gonna be trouble. And no, we, no, no, no. We're not meeting. I mean, we are sort of getting, uh, you know, meeting online, getting organized together. Junction to access the correct carriage signing. How do I do that? I have no idea. How do I do that? That was 270 meters ago. Was I supposed to have stopped? Damn it. now? Yep, there we are. So we did something wrong there. Didn't know that was we were supposed to stop there. I didn't see that. We've got a red light here, three meters. Yep. I didn't want it to load last checkpoint. Where was that? I hope that was the Eastbourne. Junction to access the correct, and that was 240 meters ago. Let's fly over there. So, what was that? So, that was there. What was I supposed to do there? idea. Why aren't we moving? It says 252 back. <laughs> Not that again. It's got 200, well, 120 meters for the red light and 220 
I go over the red light, then obviously we're dead. Can't do it. Don't know what to do. Maybe if we start this again and stop immediately. There's a red light. There's that stupid thing there. are flying here as well. Check it out. Wow! So, um, can't see, can't see, can't see. That's one way. That's this way. Let's see if we can get to this position here. Maybe I can walk this, right? Should be able to walk it. Maybe you're able to get out of this. Hold on. Still moving? Sitting? Sitting? Getting open up. Not that. Oh! Still moving. Going crazy here. See? So this is how you do it. So what? Do what? What do we do? Guys, any idea? Set the junction to access the correct carriage siding. I have no idea what that is. Obviously, meter away. It's here. What do I have to do? Do 
have to oh, jump here. There's something here. Ah! Yes! How was I supposed to know that? I really are. Uh, hello, how are you? Up we go. Now, what do we have to do? Go two hundred and sixty meters forward. Yeah, sorry folks about so much running. Keep on running. Oh no, you didn't want me to sing. Yeah, sorry, sorry. But gear is always just giving me ideas. Train still being washed. Ah, oh, this is the end here now. Shunt the train into the carriage sidings. That means I need to get out again. Yep. Mark three. Off. Off. And get out of here. Keep on running. Running from my train. And that me. Over all these rocks here. I believe I left the door open here. power to get moving Eastburn carriage sidings so it's not just driving and just stopping but we have other action here as well folks Duck underneath and then head back over again. And look at this, we have a little look around here at Eastbourne. This is how it looks like. Looks like this is where we will be stopped. There's the train station down there, right hand side, maybe. Let's get 
get some inside action here. Now we can do it from the outside, looks nicer. Climb down. I've climbed down. So, now what? 64 meters. This way? Yep. This way. There's our office here. And got ourselves a gold medal there. Yeah. So, that was it. Now, towards the end, we have seven viewers. Throughout the whole lot, we had four or five. Why do you guys always come at the end? At the end of two hours? Well, perhaps this hour may be the better time to stream. True, that could be right. But anyway, um, all of you that, that have just arrived here newly, have never been here before, well, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And uh, maybe you want to hang about, then uh, maybe hit that follow button here down the bottom there. Free, doesn't cost anything. And uh, join me. There was uh, one, one guy who's, or a girl, who's joined today. So thank you very much. Um, so again, um, let's update everybody. Uh, I've mentioned it twice or three times in between. Um, uh, just being a realist, Gil. Um, so what's going to happen? Today is Tuesday. Tomorrow, hopefully, the new airport uh, will be released on Tower 3D. Then we have a live video. I've already finished the video showing off the airport with really close looks. I will get into every new airline and aircraft that is being released for that airport. Uh, we will go have close-ups with the cameras and all sorts of stuff. And uh, that's going to be an hour and a half, that video. I hope you guys will watch it all the way to the end because it's uh, th there's nothing double. Everything is new that you will see. So whatever happens, it's all new. Um, that would be tomorrow, if all goes well. Day after tomorrow will be a um, regular schedule of that new airport using the schedule that is included in the game, but I will have the modifications turned on. Um, that will be on Thursday, on Friday, Paris, on Tower 3D Pro Live on YouTube. So all these ones that I just told you, it will be all live on YouTube because there's a higher viewer rate over there. Uh, so Friday, multiplayer with Eli Grimm starting at 5 p.m. 5, 5.30 maybe. Hopefully we will be on time. Saturday, no stream on Saturday. Not on Twitch and not on YouTube. Uh, Sunday, live here on Twitch again at 5.30 and uh, then Monday, Tuesday will be at 5 p.m. again. Uh, we will be going truck driving on Sunday. Uh, I feel like driving again. That was good fun yesterday. We had lots of laughs there and we had great music uh, from the radio. So um, that's what's planned. Um, apart from that, I want to say a huge thank you to all you guys who've worked on the chat and who've been talking to me. That is really, really nice. I really appreciate it. And we had with Aurelia, somebody new there as well who said hi. So hi, Aurelia. Um, and uh, <laughs> and um, yeah, 
so I think that's pretty much it for the day. So again, uh, to the Saturday you're off and no stream. So typical. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Um, yeah, and I think we will be back too late uh, for me to start a stream. So we are, we're going, we're actually visiting someone. We don't usually do that, but uh, we will um, on Saturday, probably. If something goes wrong, it can always something go wrong, then of course, 5.30. So just uh, have a look on 5.30. I'm not going to announce this on YouTube anymore because nobody's coming over from YouTube anymore anyway. It's only you bunch of guys that are always here. And then maybe somebody new who comes in from um, Twitch, he was just uh, sort of, I don't know, just looking around and see what's going on. Um, so... Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So we will have uh, if the video if the um if the um uh, what was that? I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. If if there's no uh, airport tomorrow, if the new airport does not is not being released tomorrow, then uh there will be a live stream here on Twitch. So, um, yeah, Oscar, good night. Thanks for watching again. So if the new airport does not is not being released tomorrow, there will be a live stream here on Twitch at 5 p.m. So uh, you should always think about like weekends, 5.30, all the other days uh, at, uh, at 5 o'clock. Okay, Gary, thank you very much as well. And thank you for subscribing. That is wonderful. I really appreciate it. Nason is back to say goodbye because we are finished. Nason, hope you had a wonderful dinner. Thank you very much. Um, and uh, if anybody wants to um, uh, make a donation, then go ahead and donate. If I get enough money together, then I'm going to buy some new DLCs for either the truck or the train. Um, maybe you want to subscribe. Maybe you are on Amazon Prime then you can uh, subscribe to my channel for free. You have one free subscription every month that you can give away. It doesn't cost you anything. So if you're on Amazon Prime, maybe you would like to um, subscribe to my channel. doesn't cost you a thing. So, oh, there you go. In the chat, it's already. So, all right, then. Thank you very much for watching. Take care, everybody. This has been another presentation of TP Gaming. Take care, everybody. I tip my hat for all of you spending some time with me. Thank you very much. Bye-bye, guys.